What could be more Valentine's Day than a box of candy? Well, in Dubuque, a group of nuns are serving up little slices of heaven. Shelby Kluver reports. Hallowed be your name. Atop these hills, the Sisters of the Mississippi Abbey dedicate their lives to prayer. As it is in heaven. But inside this building, this day our daily bread, the calling meets candy. From freshly wrapped caramels to mint chocolate morsels, it's a lineup of sweets all handmade by these nuns. Our business is really a blessing for us. It's a decades old process that began with the Greek candy maker sharing his secret caramel recipe with the monastery's founders. Probably at least 80, 85 percent of our annual sales is either the wrapped caramels or the coated caramels. Sister Kathleen O'Neill is general manager. To her team, caramel is a way of life. A slab is brought inside, run through a cutter to bring it into strips. From there, the sugary strip is fed into Old Faithful, a nearly century-old machine. It presses the height of the candy on the table into a very precise dimension. Each tiny square is wrapped in cellophane. We have it set right now to um, wrap 180 caramels a minute. Before being pushed out and carefully packed up. The last year, we sold a total of about 82,000 items. Including over 32 tons of caramel. And all that candy money goes right back into this monastery to support the sisters. And, and to the Holy Spirit. Spirit. Most monasteries aim to cover probably about 60, 70, 80 percent of their living expenses with their industries. Thanks be to God. And we certainly meet that goal, if not 100 percent. Valentine's Day is their second busiest time of year, with about 100 orders shipping out every day. Boxes of what some might call a sinful indulgence, but the sisters don't mind. People want to have a treat now and then. That's a great, great thing. After all, there's no sugarcoating it. These little candies are like a little piece of heaven. We give thanks. We give thanks for our, for our business and for our customers and um, for the whole operation.